Scott one, 20 seconds, Scott one, 20 seconds. First time I really watched this Danish pair was when they won the Dutch Open back in 2004. No! No! They knew back then they had potential. Such a shame that Rouge All has talked about just concentrating on her mixed doubles. They are a very, very good pair. And the Russian players now going for shots that simply aren't on. Desperation from the Golovanova. Service over. Seven. Just too flat. Hit long. Nine, thirty. Yeah, that's a great low serve from Olga Golovanova. <laughs> oh! Service over. Mm, nicely done. Deep into that back corner. It's going to go wide here. Fifteen, nine. Oh. Service foot call. Service fault calls. Shuffle struck above the waist. Ten, fifteen. Several serving rules in badminton. One of them is that the shuttle must be struck below the waist. Racket must be facing in a downward direction. Only one forward movement of the racket. You've got to keep your feet still as well. Can't be moving as you're serving. Yeah, good pressure play from the Danes. Service over. Well, it thought about it, hit the top of the tape. Decided to pull back the Danish side. <sighs> Goodness me. Court, she'd seen it. 17. Just 11. couldn't play the shuttle over and in. Certainly the right idea. Service over. Judgments. 18, 20. 
Well, the Danes were always favourites for this encounter. something absolutely dramatic happening looks as if the individual European champions in the women's doubles are going to secure Denmark's second point in this overall tie Seven match points now for Denmark. shot looks she tries to play the round the head shot because she's taking it late impossible to come over the shuttle and get it going down steeply enough <laughs> this time they convert the second time of asking and the Danish pair in the women's doubles the first women's doubles have kept this final alive. It's now two all in the overall tie due to that victory. 21-14, 21-14, symmetry in the score. And Denmark's victory.